Welcome to the Games Conversation channel. My name's Josh. And I'm Paul. We're playing through Metroid Prime today, and it's going to be awesome. It's going to be a good one. We're, we're deep, we're thick in the middle of the Phazon Mines, the pirate we are in operating it. base. Pirate operating base. We've been base. seeing a lot of... Um, a lot of various space pirates of various design. Yeah. Oh, no. What? Whoa. The poison gas chamber. <laughs> this is not good. Clear air flowing from this bendesium grate. Can we blow up bendesium? Ventilation fan is functional but offline. No, not yet. <laughs> Activation panel must be nearby. It must be. Activate it. Activate it. Oh, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> the air is literally eating my skin. <laughs> no good. <laughs> Metroids from the initial batch have matured to hunter phase. Be advised that the hunter Metroid has a siphon tentacle. It can mm. attack with it from a distance, as opposed to close combat tactic used by younger Metroids. Siphon tentacle. Increased aggression levels observed in the latest elite pirate units. Increasing phase on feed by per science team mandate by 0.07%. 0.07, that's very it's specific. It's like a, an extra quarter cup of dog food. Metroid activity is accelerating in non-frigid areas. All right, I hear the pirate music, so I don't want to get too cozy in here, but I mean, we're here, so. All magnetic rail system access must be approved by security. 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 Metroids are not responding to synthetic sustenance. They need real blood. We have reason to believe they only gain nourishment from active bioenergy mm. sources. Okay. I get that. <laughs> All organic. Gotta get... Those Metroids are... Oh! Those Metroids are... They are, are they vegan? Well, I guess they're not vegan. No, they're, but they're pretty... Um, they're health conscious, that's for sure. They're pretty aware of what they put in their body, you know? Like, yeah. All organic. It has to just be pure energy. Um, your life Just look energy. at the nutrition label. There's too many ingredients in this. I can't give this to my baby. I don't even know how to pronounce this. Right. Oh, hello. So we fought a purple one. We got some yellow ones yeah. down there. What up, Yellow. Weren't expecting that, were you, Surprise. sucker? That guy jumped around like, huh? 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 All right, is there another one? <sighs> There's another yellow. Nice. And there's a big guy down there, you know. Hey, big guy. Unit Ident Code EPG. That's I think it stands for Elite Pirate. G. Batch one. Field destination. Elite. Pirate. Elite Pirate. G. <laughs> uh, what's going on here? Science team is accepting volunteers for advanced weapon training. Some rubble here. Collapsed bendesium. We're seeing a lot. Like, like an inordinate amount of bendesium lately. Um, it's almost like we need something. I know, it's like... To help. It's telling us, like, you're lacking, you're lacking. That's what I'm hearing. Unauthorized usage of resources continues. Patterns suggest these resources are being stolen by the hunter. Increased <gasps> monitoring of all resource facilities. Immediately. Are, and we're the hunter? Oh, yeah. Big time. We're stealing resources? All of the resources. Good. I don't know what resources. I know that's maybe, what I was trying to figure maybe out. Maybe like the crates where you get energy and missiles mm -hmm. or something. I don't know. That's, that's... It's but it, I feel like that'd be pretty obvious. They act like, where is it going? Rather yeah. than like, oh, there's a crate that's been blasted open. True. Yeah. Pretty clear. Which is probably it's more like you know the the break room. Like <laughs> someone's not stocking the Kramer anymore. But <laughs> Samus took it. <sighs> Recon teams are searching for the hunter's gunship. Uh-oh. Science team oh. believes it employs a sophisticated cloaking device beyond our capabilities. Aside from dumb luck, we may never discover its location. Did they really just say dumb luck? Mm -hmm. We must contain or eliminate our Aaron. Failure to comply with command decree is not an option. They called us by name. 
Shows that ruins areas are off limits until further notice. Okay, so we're getting a little spooked, a little spookied. So are these just like leftover flyers that we're reading? Like, do they, they still print off flyers <laughs> and post them on <laughs> Those walls? Those are the bulletin boards. Yeah. Of course, it offline. Or is this just like the last left email? Like someone just. Oh yeah. This it's is just why they up tell the you. Screen. To put your computer to sleep. As yeah, you all those away. like guys that attacked us, they were like busy working until the doors <laughs> opened. Like, oh, I didn't have time to lock my computer. I didn't. I didn't lock my computer. <laughs> Cryopod damaged. Uh -oh. All available troopers report to Mine Security Command. There's so much, so much lore bits coming up. Lore, 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 lore. There's a ton of computer terms. Our enemies will tremble before the might of our elite forces. That's the email he got. Just, <laughs> just a propaganda email. <laughs> Unauthorized. Or maybe he was writing it. Maybe he's, know. yeah, creating He's it. like the, a part of the social media team. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Retweet. <laughs> Hashtag, yeah, that, those face on mine. <laughs> Unauthorized Metroid feeding strictly prohibited. Death to the hunter. Death to all who, to, who oppose us. And he's making yeah, like a nice definitely... infographic yeah. with it. You know? <laughs> <laughs> all right, Josh Data. Our space pirate Data. Elite pirate Upsilon's propensity for Phazon has enabled our research team to infuse it far beyond our safety restrictions. And the results have been extremely encouraging. It's constant Phazon diet nom 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 has increased its mass exponentially but it has retained all mental faculties and shows dexterity with all elite weaponry including plasma incendiary launchers and the shamalon chameleon i believe chameleon what was the other word manta i don't know what that issued is. <laughs> for cloaking purposes elite pirates upsilion exhibits miraculous healing abilities when injured it seeks out phase on deposits and coats itself in the substance hmm, which instantly mends the creature's wounds the subject which we are codenaming omega pirate based on these developments shows potential to be a new standard for our armies Ooh. our only concern at this point is its potential over dependence on phase on oh, okay Test results from battle simulation Samus Aaron are promising. Elite units report a 74% success ratio against Aaron in testing. High Command is pleased but expects a higher ratio by Project's end. They've put a lot of thought into battling us and responding to us. Yeah. And you wouldn't know it. Uh, and you uh, wouldn't, uh, Other yeah. than by reading these things. Because <laughs> more often than not, I feel like we walk in a room and they're like, <gasps> all the training what I yeah there's like the one commander guys remember your training <laughs> <laughs> okay okay so there's so many little pirate guys around elite pirate there's three pirate uh you know experiment guys Do, are, is this similar to the one we destroyed yeah, I think this is the guy, the same type of guy that walked out, and we were like, he's so slow. Yeah, he was really intimidating initially. Right. But in battle, it was like, mm, he's kind of pokey. Initially. <laughs> he's like a little pokey puppy. Hello. So I read that, and I don't know if this is true for uh -huh. this version of the game, but when you blast a door, there's always a delay. And that's because it's loading. on the GameCube, they were really pushing that system to its limits. For sure, yeah. And so... Cryosleep. Cryosleep team. Unit modifier. Elite pirate storage. Or as we like to call them, an EP EPG. G. EPG. I don't Did like... he have his hands crossed? Yeah, like... he's... He's uh, like in his meditative rest. state. <laughs> they make me like nervous. Like, is it gonna open? Yeah, you know, at some point something's just gonna bust through. But not today. Not today, sir. All right. This is a 
spooky looking place. Yeah, so in order to really push the system to its max, it would have to load. Did you share that initially? Maybe you told me that. No. Multiple safety system malfunctions detected. Unit should be taken offline immediately. So this, you know, are your um, alarm bell? Ugh. Ring a ding ding yeah. ding ding ding. So not only is there a big floor about to jump down to, there's also a lock on the door now. That's that's not a good sign. No, you don't want that. No. Phase on processing and security systems are taxing the dynamo beyond safety tolerances. Oh, we did get like a a tip that was like power surges, and it took us to a room called the dynamo, which must uh. be this. Though the com the conversion to geothermal power is easing the drain on our systems, it is not enough. Further power use at current levels could lead to system failure. Dynamo maintenance team is not responding to service call. <laughs> Rerouting. They're all on the smoke break. Rerouting request <laughs> to central command. Oh, I love that. I'm, I'm copying your superiors. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we'll see. They really, we do really get like to see behind the curtain with the space pirates. Yeah. Oh gosh. Okay. Um, what is that? It's not a ghost. No, it looks like like one of those sentry robots, but all I know is our invisible? danger meeting is off the charts. That's not helping. That's. Oh, I don't want to be stuck back there. Invisible. How That's I, not working. Oh. oh. What is it? I don't know. Something. It just hit something. So walk me through. What have you tried? Well, I've tried scanning. Didn't work. And I tried the thermal visor. Didn't help. Yeah. I think I'm just supposed to kind of... Eyeball it? Yeah. But, but it seems like whatever you shoot just goes straight through it. Well, there was one time it hit and it turned into kind of a form. Bow, bow, bow. I love that it's just like shooting at this important dynamo that produces energy for the whatever. Right, it seems like it should be a little careful. Oh, I wonder if... Um... Oh, there ah, we go. The wave buster. The whip. Latching on. Okay, so we opened up it. a hole in the flow. Looks like a puzzle to me. I'll say so. Puzzles feel mildly safe. Like, I'm not going to get attacked by an enemy, hopefully. Where did the hole go? Where are you, hole? Oh, right there with the fairy dust that's coming up. Okay. Ooh, even the puzzly music. It's a maze. Um... What's that in the floor? Is that bad? Mm -hmm. Nice. Oh, okay. Um, oh, so... So I also learned that the version of this, the story that uh, we're playing... Yeah. Through on this system, like this... On the, what are the we? Trilogy the trilogy version? The trilogy version. Yeah. Is not what was on the GameCube. The GameCube, in the well, in North America, I should say. So apparently, when it originally came out, North America had a, like a different story. This goes to you talking about how they called mm. Samus something different like originally. They used to call her, I think it was the Hatchling or the Newborn, maybe, and now they call her the Entrusted One. So the North America version had quite a few differences compared to the version that was released but in not like Europe a, and Japan. Not like a huge difference in story, though, right? Just wordings, maybe? I think, like, um, wordings, but also, like, the origin of oh. Metroid Prime. Oh, okay. From what I read specifically. Mm. Like, how Metroid Prime, like, where it came about or it okay. was created or something. Power Bomb acquired, by the way. Woo! You can destroy... Uh, 
it's the strongest morph ball thing. They do not have unlimited ammo. They can break Vindesium. Mm. Finally, we have it. Thank goodness. Okay, tell me more. Bandesium busters, tell what, me that, more, what I used to call it. And what I want to warn you about is, uh, you know, ye old fashioned spoilers, Josh. Not everyone knows exactly what you're referencing, you know? Yeah, yeah. Um, before I go in here, while you while you tell me your, your research, I think, I pray. What is it? <sighs> what is it? A save? save station. Ah, oh, thank goodness. One of the very few... In the mines. <sighs> Cheers. Cheers to save stations. <sighs> yeah, well, I won't go any further. I, I, and I don't even know the differences. Okay. I, just, I just know that there was a difference. And for this game, they went with the Japan, European version. Okay. So it seems like that's canon. For the original North American yeah. release. Well, I would say, because we talked about it in one of our episodes, that like at the time this was released, I don't know that an entire trilogy was planned, or a saga. Uh, so mm -hmm. it could have been North America kind of playing fast and loose with the translation, not knowing that something else was coming. Yeah. And maybe Japan didn't know either, because I feel like there was a big gap, but maybe not. Yeah. So, but yeah, the I would say if you played this as a self-contained game, right? Well, here's a caveat for those watching and for you. Normally, I know you don't love to go for a hundred percent. I've been doing my best to kind of be thorough as we go, but I know that getting a hundred percent in game will show something new at the end mm. that will help us as we go towards the other games. Mm -hmm. So. So, uh, like I say, if you had just played this game as self-contained and maybe yeah. not even gotten the secret ending, you'd just be like, oh, and kind of wash your hands and be like, that was fun. Uh -huh. But it does tether, and I think, uh, yeah, maybe the translation originally was like, yeah. n with that, not that in mind. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, the keeping of pets has been suspended until what? further notice. <laughs> what? Get that ferret out of the break room. Domestic beasts have been deemed highly susceptible to phase on madness and are thereby a hazard to personnel. All gronkats and all baps must be disposed of immediately. Failure to comply will result in the loss of pay for a cycle and reduce rations. Wow, it's funny to think of space pirates with pets. Yeah. <laughs> An entire shift of dynamo workers have been transferred following bouts of phase on madness. Units have reported to science team for use in laboratory studies and the new elite pirate program. Their dementia will make them adequate training adversaries for the elite team. Oh, wow. So if you go crazy from phase on madness, you are sent to do battle with the elite team. They're brutal. My word. What are these little purpley platforms? They're like, not, not everything's lost. We can repurpose this. Yeah. Well, so you had a few bad days. You know, your life can still have meaning. Meanwhile, they're, the space pirates apparently have like little chihuahuas. Yeah, old they, maps. <laughs> but, then, but then they're like, mm, must dispose of them immediately because yeah. they are susceptible to That's face right. on. <laughs> Say goodbye to Fluffy. Poor Fluffy. Thank you so much for joining us today on the Games Conversation channel. Hopefully you enjoyed today's episode. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. And ring the bell. Yeah, go for it. And we'll see you in the next episode.